back to Honest Reactions. I am Mike. And I am Derek. And we are here for your entertainment. And today we're going to watch uh, what I'm assuming is the last trailer for the Mad Max video game, because that comes out in a couple of weeks here. Uh, so let's get into it. And cigarette burn. Peggy 18. Look behind you. A dune after dune of drifting, half-forgotten terrors. You flee them. These vast phantoms and the madness that crawls inside. Griffa can help you venture down to where you daren't go yourself and lay bare your true promise. have grown into a violent thing. A man of solitude drifting across these sands. Fearing those who make you feel human. You know nothing of me. I know what you seek, and I know where you can find it. There's something brewing out there. War boys from Gastown are tightening the new spheres like. show you the light, help you survive. People can bring you the solace you so desperately desire. War boys have been sighted, prepping most likely for an assault on our beloved ship. You wish to know more about yourself? More about the man you've become? But this is a very different world, my friend. You tell me, son. Tell you what? Tell me why I shouldn't land a slug right between your eyes. If you hope to survive, navigate the flood, escape the past that forever haunts you, then open your eyes. In the darkest hour, the believers standing upon the sacred sand will behold the true light. I'm looking hard. There's nothing. Look again. It's right there in front of you. I, I hope it's as open world as it looks like it's going to be. Well, open world, and it looks like the story elements are actually going to be good, not just a bunch of exploded cars. Yeah. Um, uh, looks like there's going to be several different factions that you're possibly going up against, mm -hmm. but one mega bad guy. Yeah. Uh, the, yeah. Uh, gas, gas tone? Yeah. So apparently they eat a lot. Well, they mentioned the war boys from Gas Town, but but that's it's the same war boys from Fury Road. Mm hmm You know, so I'm. You know, again, much like the movie, the inclusion of the V eight interceptor in this game kind of puts where this lands in the timeline sideways for me. But like uh, Josh was saying, uh, the the Mad Max stories aren't really necessarily based on timelines. They're not necessarily the same continuity because they're stories told by people based on their point of view. Right, which is valid, except if you look at Fury Road, Max is the narrator of that story. I get what Josh was saying is that the, the, the narrator of the story may be misremembering certain events. Mm -hmm. uh, and and the, you know, the movie is built around the narrator telling that story. But in Fury Road, Max was the narrator. So, um, but no, it's just I'm, I'm 
is this supposed to be after Fury Road and they're trying to, you know, establish their community and mm. keep that solid against everybody who's, you know, in the surrounding area? Because there's the, the guys in the super spiky uh, VW bugs, mm -hmm. um, you know, and then the guys out in the hills who uh, ride around on the dirt bikes. And, you know, and then there's Gas Town and the Bullet Farm and, you know, so... It, I'm I'm interested in, in seeing what like the political landscape of this is, mm -hmm. but either way, it's it it's it very looks, intriguing it looks, to me. It looks yeah, cool. It looks really nice. I mean, it's you, you you know how much I love that movie. Yeah. You know. Well, the whole series. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, Fury Road really took Mad Max to the next level. It did. It it um. For what would seem like a really limited sort of genre, they've definitely gone to some interesting places with it. You know, not to suck George Miller's dick or anything, but it, but if it's available. it's cool, it's exciting, it's really good stuff. But before this turns into a twenty-minute conversation about how awesome the Mad Max franchise is, we should probably end this. Yeah, the game looks really cool. It looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, hopefully, it's very deep. I'm hoping for a lot of. Uh, interesting crafting opportunities. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I think that, you know, if there's not, it, it would be kind of a shame. Um, you know, looking for some interesting story stuff, and of course, the explosions and blood and guts and all that good shit. But anyway, thanks. We'll go on about shit later. Awesome.